Assalamualaikum and very good day My name is Najah Adila Ahmad Yusof I'm from group 6 MBF 5A For deposit and financing for that My group members consist of 5% That is Umi, Nur Alvina, Najira, Anis and Nur Adiba Instructed by our lecturer Sir Muhammad Faizal bin Basri We start first with the introduction to CIMB Islamic CIMB Islamic member height is a subsidiary of CIMB Group Gold Holdings Merhat. They were based in Malaysia and licensed under Malaysian Islamic Financial Services Act 2013. They prohibit the payment or receipts of earth interest riba and promotes risk sharing and ethical financial practice. They were under the, the supervision of the CIMB Islamic Bank Shariah Committee and they were practicing the principles of Islamic finance. So the first type of deposit accounts is saving account I plus. Saving account I plus is practicing Tawaru vis a vis commodity Murabaha. The bank who will accept money deposits and use Islamic finance principles called Tawaruk and Commodity Murabaha. Tawaruk involve buying and selling commodities for profit, while Commodity Murabaha is a sale transaction based as deferred payment. The bank Acting as the account holder's agent will use the money in the savings account I plus to buy a commodity on a business deal. To purchasing the commodity, the bank will sell it back to the account holder on deferred payment. The price for this sale includes the original amount, deposit, the principal amount, and a profit component, Murabaha price. The bank act as uh, the account holder's agent in this sale. So the entire process of buying and selling the commodity is referred to as a commodity trade transaction. In saving account I plus, the minimum deposit is 250 ringgit required to open the account of saving account I plus using the bank standard form and only Ringgit Malaysia can be deposited. Minimum deposit required in order to maintain it, it depends on the type of accounts, fees and charges the account holder can be charged in saving account I plus. As you can see in the table here, there is eight types of charges that can be charged to the account holder. First is account certification, 20 Ringgit, letter of reference, 30 Ringgit, Dormant account fee 10 ringgit, stop payment instruction 20 ringgit, and additional or reproduction of statement saving account 2 ringgit per page, and also account closing within 3 months of its opening 20 ringgit, third party mandate service charge 10 ringgit, and lastly, the third party mandate stamp duty 10 ringgit. Next, we move to the next slide for the profit or hibah payments and rebate called IBRA. So in saving account I plus any forfeit earned on the Murabaha price, the price of the commodity bought and sold as part of the Islamic financing, and any gift or hibah we call hibah will be added to the account holder's account at the end of each month. So the account holder agrees to provide a rebate called IBRA to the bank under two conditions. First is downward charge in prevailing rates. And next is withdrawal before maturity payment. As we can see in the slide, there is the profit portion of the Murabaha price shall be calculated in the following manner. So the principal amount will be times by bank internal rate or prevailing rate, whichever higher, times N divided by 365 days. For a period of 366 days or as many applicable and represent the number of days between the sale transaction at the end of the month or any other period set by the bank. So the profit rate will be based on how much you have in the account. For the first 100,000, you will got profit rate 10 cents per annum. And then 
uh, for the next 100,001 cents to 200,000, you will get 15 cents. So next is 200,000 to 300,000, you will get 25 cents. And lastly, above 300,000, you will get 35 cents per annum. That's all for me. Then we move to the next person. Assalamualaikum and a warm greeting, especially to Professor Faisal. My name is Uya Amira binti Yahya and today I'm going to proceed inside about Syambi Berhad's deposit products which is the Syambi current account I. This Sharia compliant transactional account is designed for day-to-day -day financial activities, upholding the principles of Sharia by avoiding interest and embracing profit and loss sharing. What set it apart is the use of the Tawaru concept where returns stem from equitable buy and sell transactions aligning seamlessly with Sharia principles. With a modest minimum deposit of RM500, the account ensures inclusivity for a broad spectrum of individuals and businesses. Beyond the deposit, it offers return on investment and the practical convenience of a checkbook facility, enhancing the ease of daily financial transactions. In essence, the CIMB Current Account I embodies a commitment to ethical finance, accessibility and practical convenience. Let's continue into the key features of the CIMB Current Account I. It's offering a Sharia compliant solution for both individuals and businesses. First off, we have banking facilities. This account is not just about storing money. It is complete suit, providing a checkbook a debit card and secure online banking. People can manage transactions, make purchases and withdraw cash from ATMs with some accounts offering additional benefits like overdraft option and SMS alert. Now uh, to talk about the power duo which is checkbook and debit card, the CIMB current account I give people the traditional reliability of checks for a specific situation and the modern convenience of electronic transactions through a widely accepted debit card. It is all about versatility in managing your financial transaction. Lastly, we have statement-based transparency, which monthly statements enhance transparency providing a detailed overview of transaction. These features improve people user uh, experience by offering organized insight into financial transaction and position. However, there are also several of constraints for the product. Firstly, when it comes to low or no interest rates in current account, it is important to note that this account usually provide minimal to no interest on the account balance. If people primary goal is to grow their savings significantly through interest earnings, a different approach might be more suitable. While current accounts serve their purpose for day-to-day -day transactions, if people aiming for substantial interest earning, exploring other account options could be a strategic move. Second, understanding the fees and charges Associated with the CIMB current account I is vital for effective financial management. Whether tied to specific transactions, low balances or particular services, awareness of these charges empowers individuals to make informed decisions and avoid unexpected costs. By familiarizing oneself with the specific types of fees, such as transaction fees, service charges, and penalties for low balance, account holders can proactively navigate their financial journey, aligning decisions with their goals. Regularly reviewing account terms ensure ongoing awareness and adaptability to any changes in banking policies. Contrib contributing to a clear understanding of the financial landscape and promoting optimal financial well-being. 
Next, in managing your CRMB current account I, it is crucial to be aware that certain accounts come with minimum balance requirements. These requirements act as a threshold and falling below it may have implication on your account. Staying informed about the minimum balance requirements and proactively maintaining the necessary balance ensures that people's CIMB current account I operates optimally without incurring additional fees or account downgrades. Finally, yet importantly, Islamic banking operates on principle aligned with Sharia, emphasizing ethical and transparent financial transactions. For products like the CIMB current account I, understanding this principle is fundamental. Embracing Islamic banking principles with the CIMB current account I is a conscious choice that goes beyond the financial realm. It is about harmonizing your banking practices with your ethical belief. Whether to choose Islamic banking or conventional options, the key is to make a to make an informed decision that resonates with your value. I would like to explain about foreign currency current account in CIMB Islamic. Uh, for tax and definition foreign currency account. CMB Islamic typically offers Sharia compliant version of various foreign currency account similar to their conventional counterpart. Money deposit and any sum of money to be subsequently deposit in the foreign currency current account should be based on Sharia principle as Tawaro and commodity Murubah. So for foreign currency current account in CIMB Islami, this account allow to search in different foreign currency while comply with Islamic banking principle. It offer fle flexible for regular transaction without interest bearing features. Two type of foreign currency current account in available in CIMB Islami is trade foreign currency current account and investment foreign currency current account. So for eligibility for foreign currency current account in CMB Islamic is individual age 18 years old and above, second joint account is allowed, and for requirement to apply foreign currency current account in CMB Islamic is, is need to have IC and or passport, and second minimal initial deposit of USD 500. So we go to the fee and charges of foreign currency current account in CIMB Islamic. The fee and charges for a foreign currency current account in CIMB Islamic can vary based on the specific type of account and the service you utilize. Here are some typical fee and charges that might apply. First currency conversion fee, a fee may be levied when converting funds from one currency to another within the account. Second, account maintenance fee. Some bank charge a fee for maintenance the account, especially if, if it fall below a specific minimum balance. Third, transaction fee. Charge my apply for transaction such as a uh, Wire, wire transfer, withdrawal, or other banking activity of uh, in foreign foreign currency. For statement request fee, there might be a fee for additional statement or transaction record beyond a curtain frequency. Frequency, uh, and last but not least, are the charge additional charge could include fee for return chair, overdraft, or specific service related with the account. So we go to advantage and disadvantage of foreign currency current account in CIMB Islamic. Uh, first, Sharia complaints. This account ad adhere to Islamic principle, ensuring they are free for interest, riba, and follow Sharia guideline. Second, currency diversification. Allow holding various 
foreign currency reducing exposures to currency risk and providing diversification. Third, proportionally profit earning. Depending on the account types, customer might earn profits on their balance, aligned with Islamic investment principle. Last but not least, global transaction. Facility international transaction in different currency without the need for frequent conversions. The disadvantage of foreign currency current account in CIMB Islamic is exchange rate risk. Fluctuation in currency value can lead to potential gain or loss when converting between currency. Second, portion tier fees, charge or fee for currency conversion, maintenance or transaction might apply impact the overall account return. Third, minimum balance requirement. Some account may require a minimum balance, limited access to funds or affecting portion share earning. Ensure to truly understand the terms just and profit rates specific to CIMB Islamic foreign currency current account to make informed decision and based on customer financial needs and adheres to Islamic banking principle. The fourth deposit account of CIMB Islamic is the fixed return income account I maturity returns. So it's a FD account, a type of saving account or certificate of deposit offered by uh, CMB Islamic where depositors uh, make deposit for a specific period of time and in return, the depositor will gain a fixed uh, profit rate until a given maturity date. So a CIMB uh, Islamic Fixed Return Income Account I Maturity Return is a Sharia compliant uh, deposit investment account operate under the principle of uh, Tawaru and Murabaha with community Murabaha. So the earned profit will be shared uh, between the depositor uh, and CMB Islamic according to a pre-agreed profit sharing ratio. And for the transition, the account holder will uh, assign the bank, which is the CMB Islamic, as their agent for the purpose of negotiating, carry out and perform all activities uh, related to the series of purchase and sales transition of the community, uh, which is known as Community Murabaha Transactions. So the bank as an agent will execute all actions necessary to buy the commodity using funds held uh, by the account holder to the credit of the uh, FRIA I, uh, or known as principal amount on a spot basis on a business day through the purchase agreements, certificates and other instruments and also on behalf of the account holder to sell the commodity to the bank at a deferred uh, payment basis for a price uh, equal to the whole of the principal amount plus with the profit, which is the Murabaha price. And for the requirement of the uh, fixed uh, return income account I, uh, the individual age 18 and above are eligible to open this uh, account or joint account uh, with CMB Islamic and the deposit placements that can be made uh, by the depositor with the tenor from one month to up to 60 months. And the minimum deposit placements uh, for this account is 5,000 uh, ringgit for a tenor of one month and a minimum uh, ringgit Malaysia of 1,000 ringgit for the deposit placements from two months up to 60 months. And CIMB Islamic uh, offered the rate profit to the account holder depending on the amount of deposit placement and the tenor uh, in this uh, fixed return income account I. So for tenor from one month, the profit rate will be 2.5% and, and the tenor for two months it is 2.50%. 5% and for tenor of 3 months 
to uh, five months is uh, 2.65%. So from six months uh, to 40 months is 2.7% uh, profit rate. Uh, from 15 uh, until 35 months, it will be 2.75% profit rate. And from 36 to 60% of the inner deposit placement will be 2.8% profit rate. And for the withdrawals, CMB Islamic has permitted uh, the depositors to withdraw uh, the money from the account for amount up to all multiples of 1,000 ringgit. So for any placement and renewal that be made before November 1, 2018, there will be no profit uh, paid to the uh, account holder for any withdrawn or account terminated. But after the placement and renew renewal made uh, after the November 1, 2018, so there will be still no profit for three months then uh, of the deposit placement. But there will be uh, still no profit even after four months and above then uh, if there, there is no completion made of three months then uh, from the depositors. But after the completion of three months then uh, so for any fully or partially withdrawn amount, there will be half of the contracted rate profit for each completed month of the withdrawn amount is paid to the account holder. And for fee and charges of uh, this FRIAI account, uh, there are charges and uh, fees imposed by the CMB bank, uh, which are for additional and reproduction of statement for FRIAI account uh, in the period up to one year. So the charges will be uh, 10 ringgit for the upfront and additional 2 ringgit for additional page. And for the period that exit one year, the amount will be 30 ringgit for the upfront and additional page for 2 ringgit. And there will be no charge for withdrawal of FRIEI uh, and uh, withdrawal via banker check will be 50% including the stamp duty charges. The first financing product of CIMB Islamic is the term financing I secured by ASB certificate. Actually, this is the kind of personal financing product. So, Amana SP is actually a Amana Sambumi Putra. It's a unit trust fund with fixed price of one ringgit offered to the Malaysian Bumi Putras for the purpose of long term investments. So, alternatively, investor or the customer can opt to finance their ASB, ASB investment other than buying units with their cash. So uh, for this term financing I secured by SB certificate, uh, the contract concept of Sharia is commodity Murah Bahata Waru. So the requirement for this term financing I secured by SB financing uh, is only eligible for Malaysian Bumi Putra individual age 18 and above with evidence of income and there is also limited joint application to only parents, spouse, siblings or adult children. And some features of term financing I secured by SB uh, certificates is this financing is backed by the unit of uh, Aman Saham Bumi Putra and Aman Saham Bumi Putra to from the Amana Saham National Berhad. And this uh, financing facility tenor can be met uh, from five years up to a maximum of 40 years uh, or 70 years of 
the applicant age, whichever is earlier. And the monthly installment payment uh, is calculated uh, based on the variable rate frameworks, uh, which is uh, not or uh, uh, which is based on the standardized base rate that provided it will not exceed the shilling profit rate. So uh, the standardized base rate will be realized on the Bank Negara Malaysia BNM benchmark rate. So the benchmark rate is of right now. The monetary policy community of Bank Negara Malaysia determine the overnight policy rate, which is the benchmark rate for the SPR. So for this uh, term financing I secured by ASB certificate, CIMB Islamic uh, has offered promotion campaign for variable financing rates depending on the financing amount uh, take. So the promotion uh, will be valid uh, starting from 9 May 2020 until further notice. And following the latest rate of standardized base rate as at 9 May 2023 is 3% per annum. So for any financing amount 13,000 ringgit and above with tenor between 5 to 20 years. So the financing rate offered by CMB Islamic is... Um, uh, standardized base rate which is 3% plus with the spread of the bank which is 1.45% so the financing rate would be 44.45% and financing amount uh, 30,000 ringgit above with tenor between 21 to 40 years so the st standardized base rate 3% plus with the 1.5% spread so the total financing rate would be 4.5 percent and for any financing amount that below 30,000 ringgit so the financing rate would be the SPR 3 percent plus with the 1.75 percent so the equal of the finance rate is 4.75 percent and also this uh, financing uh, has offered the financing protection so CMB Islamic encourage uh, the customer to uh, take the optional takaful or, or this protection plan named uh, group term financing takaful uh, to protect their financing. So the last, the Sun Life Malaysia takaful, Berhad is the one company that manage and issue this takaful plan. CIMB Higher Purchase I stands out as a Sharia compliant financing option emphasizing ethical transactions and adherence to Islamic principles. One of its key features is the use of the Tawaru concept, ensuring transparency throughout the financing process. Whether you are now, let's explore the application process. It typically involves providing necessary documentation such as proof of identity, income and details about the intended asset. For businesses, additional documents such as business registration letter and financial statement may be required, depending on the business structure. For individuals, eligibility requires a minimum age of 18 years old, depending on the credit assessment and acceptable guarantor may be required. The necessary documentation includes a copy of the National Registration Identity Card, a valid driving license, and evidence of income. For non-individual entities like sole proprietors, partnerships, companies, clubs, and else, eligibility involves being registered with SSM, Suruhanjaya Syarikat Malaysia, Registrar of Society. An acceptable guarantor is also required and the documentation varies based on the type of non-individual entity. CIMB Higher Purchase I stands out as a Sharia compliant financing option, emphasizing ethical transactions and adherence to Islamic principles. One of its key features is the use of the Tawaruk concept. 
ensuring transparency throughout the financing process, whether you are eyeing a slick car, a nimble motorcycle, or a robust SUV, or any vehicle in between, CIMB High Purchase I has you covered. The financing solution accommodates a diverse range of vehicles, catering to various preferences and needs. Next, CIMB Instant Approval Benefit is a game changer in the application process for higher purchase I. It is designed with your convenience in mind, streamlining the journey from application to approval. This feature ensures efficient and timely approval for your financing needs. No more waiting for extended periods. CIMB Instant Approval provide real-time feedback on customer application status. Lastly, CIMB Clicks is not just an online banking platform. It is people gateway to efficient financial management. When it comes to easy payments, CIMB Clicks has people covered with CIMB Clicks. Customers can efficiently manage their accounts. From checking balance to conducting various transactions, it is customer all-in-one solution. So, in conclusion, whether people are a fan of online transaction or prefer ATMs or want a versatile options, CIMB Clicks offers a user-friendly platform tailored to you to people needs. As for the fee and charges apply, customers should be aware of any applicable fees. This including processing fees, administrative charges, and penalties for late payments or early settlement. The specific details can be found in CIMB Terms and Condition. Hi, my name is Nurul Adiba binti Muhammad Mislan and today we will discuss about one of financing products CIMB which is Home Flexi Smart Eye. Home Flexi Smart Eye is a Sharia compliance financing facility that offers your property as security. Depending on the borrower's credit assessment, the bank may require grantors to guarantee the obligation. The facility offers flexibility Stability in the repayment and withdrawal subject to fee per withdrawal. Okay, now let me see the features. Flexible repayment. Customer have the option to make extra payment or montage and withdraw the those advance fund when needed. Okay, next, a uh, lower profit rate. By depositing repayment into the link special Muharaba current account I, CMCAI, customer may be charged a lower profit rate. Uh, next, uh, the margin of financing, uh, CMB Islamic can provide up to 90% margin of set, uh, financing for purchasing complete or under construction properties. Additionally, uh, CMB also cover the cost of group mortgage, takaful plan, GMTP, legal fee, and valuation fee. Next, uh, variable profit rate. The, the profit rate is calculated based on variable rate, which means customer monthly payment may be changed with the Islamic bank base rate. Insurance while company motif takaku plan GMTP is optional but is recommend to protect the borrower property in case uh, the something that you don't want happen so the takaku will protect your property. Requirement for application home flexi smart eye the first thing we need is identification document. For Malaysia, uh, we need a copy of NRIC, Sales and Purchase Agreement or uh, also known as Booking Form, 
And for foreign applicant, we need copy of passport, minimum 6 month validity, and sales and purchase agreement or booking form. Secondly, we need income document. For individual applicant, we need letters 3 month pay slip, letters EPF statement, or letters 3 month bank statement. For individual applicant based on commission, we need letter 6 month bank statement, letter 6 month commission statement, and lastly, for self employed applicant, uh, we need a business registration, letter 6 month business bank statement, letter form B with tax payment receipt. CMB Islamic Express Cash Financing I is a Sharia compliant personal financing facility that offered by bank. It designed to provide customer with quick and hassle-free access to cash for various personal needs. Here are some key features commonly associated with the financing. First, Sharia compliant. As a Islamic financing product, X Cash Financing Act adheres to Sharia principles that ensuring compliance with Islamic finance guidelines. Secondly, quick approval and disbursement that offer a quick and straightforward application process with fast approval and disbursement of fine. Thirdly, fake repayment tenure, it which is it, it usually come with the a fixed repayment period that providing predictability in monthly installment amount. Next, online application. CMB Islamic provide the convenience of applying for the financing online, simplifying the application process. Lastly, competitive profit rate that offer competitive of profit rate instead of interest rate and it based on principle of Islamic finance. The profit rate is the amount charged by the bank providing the financing. Eligibility for application express cash financing I is, is open for Malaysian citizen only with age between 21 to 60 years old. Application must be submitted individually. Application journey are not permitted. The minimum monthly income is 800 with the variable allowance and overtime. A minimum of 6 months of working experience or company ownership offering the financing range from 3000 ringgit at the minimum to uh, 15000 or up to 8 times gross monthly income whichever is lower for conclusion the CIMB Islamic Bank is one of the f the Islamic banking industry pioneering Islamic finance in the global they established a strategy plan to dominate Islamic finance through South Asia. Their contribution in corporate social responsibility managed to connect the CIMB Islamic Bank with their communities, help to support the education, health, community and well-being, economy empowerment and climate and environment of communities. Also, to build the trust and bonds among the communities, give their beneficiaries to the environment. The dedication of CIMB Group, Sinjian Berhad, bring the CIMB Islamic Bank one of the tops of Islamic banking in the South Asia. Furthermore, the bank's product and service have received one of the suitable product among the customer. In fact, the dedication of offering their client financial solutions follow the Sharia law. The institution have offered suitable product from the individual, business and corporate, including Sukut and Takaful. CMB Islamic Bank enable the Islamic economy, the type of the product and its features help the basic needs. Every product have complete detail for the customer that also sweet need of financial support. However, every industry come with the issue that might happen in every product they have. So, MB Islamic Bank also made put run for the issue they have to face. The product need to be reviewed from the perspective of payment and repayment itself. The financing of every type 
of product must be taken into consideration otherwise it may affect the customer. The eligibility need to ensure that every product is suitable for some group and backgrounds. The product provide also need to be reviewed based on the daily and current needs of some customer based on the current economy situation. So MB Islamic Bank need to organize a solid strategy to maintain the use of their product by all customers in order to enjoy the best service. The dependability of CMB Islamic Bank service also show customer loyalty to the company. CMB Islamic Bank can also achieve the status of the best Islamic banking in the world if it provides the appropriate benefits of Sharia law. In addition, CMB Islamic Bank have, has highlighted the withdrawal and benefit of Islamic banking and will also support the Islamic economy throughout Malaysia and South Asia and internationally.